plans are commencing um, to rob. Uh, plans are commencing to plan to rob Veterans Vault, as our thieves are trying to think of the best way to get up to the actual vault itself. Um, there's been talks of invisibility, talks of going to the uh, the uh, top, uh, the balcony, um, but. Um, what are you guys talking about? Okay, so I think what we do is I go in looking for a job. Maybe I can no, be a security no, guard. No, 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 no. <laughs> it, it worked so uh, well the first time. It didn't work as well. It, didn't, it, it has never worked well. It actually okay, how, kind of work in, well. In, in, in what time. world did that work well? Well, there was a, a different version that it worked well. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it really worked well. <laughs> the first time, yes. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, Maybe if someone else went in as a guard instead of Samantha, or went yes. with Samantha as a guard in. I say, I love Raz's idea of making people invisible. Uh, I can get in through the balcony, right? Yes. Well, I, I can mean, just. Well, Raz well, can well, fly. Well, we got to get up to the top so that we can use Annabelle's map to see exactly what we're dealing with rather than this uh, kindergarten refrigerator project. Yeah. What other yeah. buildings are around it? Right. Uh, it's actually quite, there's no other buildings around it. Um, it's quite just kind of in the middle of um, nothing. Why are all the places we go to rob out in the middle of nowhere? Right, and I can I can Those actually are the best places to rob. I can get up on the roof very True. easily. I have my cat's blessing that allows me to get very stealthy up to the roof. You guys, the rest of you, turn invisible, go up the ladder to the balcony. How's that work? Well, I think that works fine. I don't have any I mean, Raz, roof. well, getting on the roof is not getting in the building. I do want to say that. Getting on the balcony is getting in a building? No, no, no. But 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 once I get up on the roof, I can help. I mean, we're going to have to take down the gods that are on the balcony. Right? Almost mm -hmm. assuredly. But I think what he's saying is the vault room doesn't have no, a no. door. And then I, no, then I can get in through the balcony. Then I can join you guys on the balcony. I understand, but mm -hmm. Viterant's space doesn't connect to the vault room. Well, Once again, we need to get on the you know, roof so that we can use Annabelle's super map to see exactly what we're dealing with because this thing was done in Crayola. That's true. Uh, yeah. If we could get onto the re the roof, but I think only two of us can get on the roof. Actually, are these slippers, uh, are those... Attunement. Attunement? Probably. I think so. They are. Okay. Can anyone else get up on the roof? Annabelle, Samantha. I can probably just climb up there regularly. With I mean, I could jump. <laughs> or I could get up there and lower a rope. Well, how about and this? I'll make a... I, I'm sure that Annabelle can climb up it. Monks are quite nimble, but I can uh, reduce Samantha, and you can put her in your pocket, and you can have a pocket, Samantha, like a poly pocket. But and then, then, if you reduce, I don't think you can also make them invisible. Yeah. Also, by the way, Samantha would only go down to small as a basically halfling size. You cannot put a halfling in your pocket. Yeah. So it'd be like a backpack, Samantha. Yeah, it'd be a backpack, Samantha. That's true. You can still throw her. <laughs> but I think I think if I could just like go up a there, psychotic Chucky doll. So I say <laughs> if, if I if I can go up there, I can drop a rope, and you guys could be invisible and climb up the rope. Yeah, well, invisible won't just... drop for for you for climbing. Let's, Let's do it. it. Let's do it. So I don't have to. Well, you, you you make you Annabelle and Samantha invisible. Done. All right. 
Um, uh, not to be a, a naysayer here, but Raz can fly. Yes. Why yeah. doesn't he just make us three invisible and he goes way up high and drops down in straight onto the roof and then we invisibly climb up? Because he wants know. to show off his spider shoes, man. Well, plus, plus, actually, for 10 minutes, I got a climbing speed. His Air, his mm. air Jordans. He, they can't see his Air Jordans if he's invisible. <laughs> 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 I just... It, I got I got way too much style to go invisible. Okay. He's <laughs> got too much style to go invisible. <laughs> they it's have terrible. to see me. But if that would make... I mean, what do you think, Raz, about that, about Samantha's idea about us going invisible and you staying visible? That's fine. I mean, the other side, too, is he could just pop into his ring, us three be invisible, and then now nobody's seen as we go in. That's true. And do you want us to go into your ring? I forgot all about my ring. <laughs> How many... Can you take anybody else in yet? How many times can you come in and out? Not till 10th level, I think. Yeah, okay. not till 10th level. Okay. I Are think... I but you can go. But you can go in and out. Yeah, just once. I think us invisible and Raz flying will probably be there good. Go. Okay. And then save his ring in case something goes down. And yeah. I can still and I can still activate my cat's blessing and go for ten minutes. I get a climbing speed and a plus two to my stealth. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. We're ready. And so we're going right. up to the roof. Okay. So you all arrive. Uh, it's a pretty stone plain building. Um, let me reveal some of these. Yes. And we're gonna come Let's in see. from behind. We do, Aiden. We do want to come in from behind, uh, like where the armor and weapons area is. Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? So coming over okay. the roof to look at the guards, not correct. Correct. Okay. All right. So coming in the back, so we put ourselves out there. Wow, this is huge. I know. And if you guys go through with your plan, you're not going to explore most of it, which is kind of sad on my part. <laughs> Anyways, um, do, 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 do. unless we want to try and go through this window right here. Yeah, what would you guys like to do? So we're, we're scouting this place out. We know we're mm -hmm. going to be invisible. What do you guys think about going inside? If I can get next to the wall, then I can use my map to see. Yes. What's going on in there? Let's. Okay, so we're all invisible. Let's walk up to the wall. This back okay. wall. Over me. As and and. This guy okay, over here. Right here. Well, no, we're in the front. We're in the yeah, yeah back here. We're yeah, in the front, here. front level. Okay. So, um, let me put myself out there. Uh, but we're not going there until we see the guard go by once. Does that make sense? I mean, even though we're invisible, it's still mm -hmm. best. To... Okay. So from there, Annabelle, use your map. All right. I'm gonna open my map. Get myself as close to the wall as possible and open my map. To see I'll keep in contact with you, Nick, through message so that yep. we can uh, I think keep that communications that open. I and I've got see. I've got your ring on. You put a ring on it. Uh oh uh oh uh oh. oh, 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 oh. <laughs> no, I gotta have that because I'm flying around waiting for you guys to. Oh, you're me, up in the okay. You're flying. Okay, you're not giving no me the go signal. You can never find the the map uh, rules on what I can see. I think it goes up to... I think see. he placed it, pinned it in Discord. What oh. is your uh, what is your class? The architect? 
Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Uh, All right, so you can... Uh, Sketch a map of the region detailed, within 50 feet, locate... Det detailed map within 20 feet, including any treasure traps and the current locations of any creatures. A uh, working diagram of an object, including a mechanic... Yeah, so, detailed map, uh, treasure traps, and current... Yeah, okay. So... Twenty feet, Jiminy. Not that far. Uh, so you get a detection of uh, two creatures right here, uh, and a creature in here right here. Okay. Oh wait, so that's. Seven. That's the uh, animals, animals and the yeah. armor and weapons. See, there might be something interesting in, this, in armors and weapons. I'm sure of it. And you said there's windows uh, on yeah, these walls too? There's a mm -hmm. window right here and we have a chime of opening. <laughs> okay. Well, I think... All right, so that's the detailed out to 20 feet, but I can see, uh, like, just the layout, like, yeah, further so that, than that? That would just be the map I gave you, basically. Okay. Is the uh, yeah. Layout. Yeah. Okay, so I say we open this window. Let's All right. See if we can get in. Um, do we want to try me? Let's let's just try and see if I can pick it. Do, do I have... Does somebody else have pick locks? We can I do. Yeah. Assist? I have a crowbar. No, no, no. That I can break things open. No. <laughs> okay. I can come down and assist. Yeah, come on down and assist. And they, is that okay for uh, giving me advantage on that? Hey, Raz, Raz might as well come with you guys. <laughs> yeah, he is. He's not gonna be doing anything. He's the only one that's yeah. visible right now. Yeah. All right. So I'm gonna roll with it. Is that okay, Aiden? I go and roll yep. it. All right. 23. Yeah, that gets a little bit open. All right. And stealth my way in to see what I can see. What, what is that thing? I'll get there. Hold on. Let me describe the room. Yes. And what are those things? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> those are the animals. Uh, three suits of armor stand against the walls with swords in hand, watching over this armory. Uh, three large chests sit along the south wall. Three suits of armor, three chests. Yep. So the armor is alive? Um. Mm -hmm. They're uh, just standing there right now. They look like mannequins. Yes. All right. Um. I am going to. Uh, boy, I wish I had detect magic. I do. You do? Oh well, then get in here. Oh no, wait. That's detect thought. Oh no, there's detect magic as a ritual. Okay. Well, that lasts for ten minutes though. So come on in and it takes ten minutes to cast. Yeah. It takes ten minutes to cast. We're, we're in. We're inside a room that's that no one's in. So this is perfect. Everyone, come on in, and we'll lock up the door. Lock up the window again. No one knows that we're here. I'm gonna, lose, to quietly, I'm gonna quietly close the window. I'm gonna lose invisibility on you whenever I try to detect magic. I, that's not a concentration, is it? It is. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because it's up for ten minutes. It's, you have to concentrate and detect magic. Ah, I also do want to point out. I do want to point out your invisibility will be gone if you do anything other than if you that's, if you attack anything. If you kind of. That's yeah. true, but it's only for an hour. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, well, let's just let's just An check the hour. Wow. Yeah. So come on in here, Raz. Um, mm -hmm. And we will. Uh, I'm just gonna kind of look around. Well, I guess as, do I have to be making stealth checks? No. As you uh, walk in, uh, after about a few seconds, I need everyone to roll initiative. Oh no! The armor's alive. It was a 
It was no, one hundred percent chance. <laughs> it would, as soon as he said, "There's armor," I was like, "Oh, okay, cool." <laughs> it's a fifty-fifty. Oh my gosh! Oh That's wow! Good initiative. I rolled the two extremes. <laughs> Come on, big money, big money, no whammy, no whammy. One. One to two initiative, not 20. That's not. Ooh, we all did good. What? Uh, guys. Yeah, no doubt. Rolling, guys, Everybody got above 20. Guys, the one time I roll a natural 20. Come on, guys. Aww. You can't do that to me. <laughs> we you guys can't do this natural to me. 20s? You, got, you guys cannot do this to me. You can't roll high when I roll high. You gotta roll <laughs> low. You gotta roll low. Nope. Three was the lowest with 17. Yeah. Well, at least I'm going over someone. Uh, oh, wait, sorry, no. Yeah, actually, no, I am still going before you. <laughs> Just barely. That's uh, all right. Ignore the T7. I will not. Uh, as, oh, let me sort this. Um, Samantha, you're going first. Cool. Um, I'm invisible. Yep. So I'm that going matter. to... That doesn't matter to this thing, by the way. Okay. Aww. Then I will bonus action rage. <laughs> okay. I'm so mad. And... Describe what I'm seeing start to move on the far side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So these appear to be uh, two uh, armors. Um, they appear to um, uh, shuffle into existence and uh, almost look like they have this red glowingness underneath them. Oh, wait, like is it them. right here or is it right over here? It's There's two. No, there's, there's one right two. next one to you. One right here apparently. and one right here. That's uncool. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, Samantha will move over. To that one. And. Yeah, I'm just gonna make an attack at it. Okay. Actually. Mm, nope, we're gonna go there. Um, and we'll make attacks with my polar, my glaive. Right. So here we go, and I'm going to reckless. Twenty-six to hit. That'll hit. Or uh, sixteen flashing damage. All right. Second attack at advantage. Ooh, eighteen to hit. That'll miss. Yep. Which one are you hitting? The one in the top? Nope. One down here. No, yeah. next to. Uh... Yep. Yeah. And right. I guess that'll be my turn. All right, Brad, it's your turn. Okay. I am going to fly across the room, I guess. Let me see. What's the distance on that? How tall's the room? Yeah. All right. I'm going to fly over to this one in the back corner. All right. And hit him with a dispel magic. Ooh. Uh, good question. Um, fourth level, fifth level. Fifth level, fifth level. fifth level. It's a third level. Well, no, he it's, is. It's my gloves that do it. Oh, it's okay, a, that's right. It's an artifact. That's right. Yeah. What, what level does that cast at? Third level. Third level, level third. I guess. Yeah. Uh, give me a charisma check. Eleven. Yeah, you see, it would have affected him, but does not appear to mess with him. Um, as he appears to not be affected by this specific dispel magic. But, it was worth a shot. Mm, right, right. As, uh... Anything else, Raz? My flight speed is what? Oh, only 30 feet. I think I'm boned. Um, 
Oh, I got five feet to fly up in the air. Okay. As uh, Nick, it is your turn. Okay, I'm invisible, right? Yep. So he cannot. He see said. Me too. He said it didn't matter. It doesn't matter. Oh, that okay, have true right. sight or blind sense or. Uh, I am going to bonus action disengage. Oh no, no, I'm not. No, you're not. Um. So I, I totally forgot that. Uh. Yeah, I'm gonna bonus action disengage, move over here, um, mm -hmm. and then fire. So I don't have advantage, but I still get my six stack if I hit. Yep. It's just gonna be harder to hit. Good luck. Unfortunately, it looks like a nine. That'll miss. That blows. Anything else? Uh, yeah, no. That's uh, that's it. All right. The Helm Tor. Mm hmm. Gonna move Ooh. down to Samantha. As it moves, I'd make an opportunity attack. Yes, you do. Yep. That's why I didn't go a space further up. <laughs> uh, twenty-one to hit. That'll hit. All right. Or nineteen slashing. Right. Um. Did you reckless? I did. Okay. Bad attacks coming at you. Mm -hmm. First one will be a 15 to hit. Uh, that hits right on the armor class. Uh, for eight oh. points of slashing. Four. four half to four. Uh, a 19 to hit. Yep. Another four slashing. Mm -hmm. uh, over 20 to hit for four slashing. Mm -hmm. I don't have my defense roller. Uh, a uh, 10 to hit? No. Okay. That'll be their turn as Annabelle. All right. I'm going to step right here up to Samantha. Okay. And I am going to swing my hand axe at the one in front of her. Okay. For 26 to hit. That'll hit. I'm going to attempt to spend a key point to uh, try to stun it. Yes. Okay, so there you go. Save yes. will be a 17. Ah, I saved. I'm going to roll my damage for that first one first. Love having monks uh, in the party. Nine. <laughs> and then I'm going to hit it again with my hand axe. Right. Ooh, natural 20. Another key Go point. Ahead. We're going to try it again. Yeah! Spin strike. All right, it fails. However, it is not affected by stunned. Oh, oh no. Oh. No, it was. All right. Yeah. Oh, right, dear. Let me try to do this at advantage. Uh, critical damage. That's yeah. It it's actually one of the few creatures in the game that's immune to stunned. Yeah. Another nine. The monk damage. killer. Oh. <laughs> and then my last one, I'm going to go ahead and flurry. Yep. Oh, that was a two, four, and eight. But my flurry gives me the disengage, which I am going to take back to here. You still have one more attack with flurry. It's two off yeah. the attack. It's just oh, when you flurry. Yeah. That was a natural one. Oh my gosh. All right. Ouch. A two, a two, and then a one. Okay. We're gonna, we're gonna go ahead and take a, just a, a quick step back. <laughs> yep. After um, seeing it not get stunned, you're just like, oh great, awesome, yeah, no, yeah. I'm afraid now. <laughs> I knew that would happen. <laughs> uh, Recalculating. Yeah. All right. Cool. Let me fix my map because I didn't do that last turn. Real quick. All right, so I have two in front of me. Neither one looking any kind of hurt at all. Right. Uh, the one up top looks really bad. The one up top looks really bad. Yeah. Is that the one that Samantha's been hitting? That's the one that Annabelle's been hitting on. I mean, that's that's oh, just right. Yeah. Okay. 
Uh, well, then I'm going to go with that one. Yep. Um, and here we go. Mm -hmm. uh, attack. Advantage. 28. That'll hit. Or 21 slashing. Ooh. This one's looking bad. And hey, hey. second attack. Gonna hit. That'll hit. Or 13 slashing. That one's crumbled. No! As I throw my polearm back into the one behind me. Or 13 bludgeoning. Alright. As that one in front of me crumbled, I just kind of go, hi -ya! <laughs> Yep. As, uh, Nice cotton. Ah, okay. Uh, let's see here. I was gonna fairy fire because of advantages and whatnot, but I think since there's only one left, I'll hit him twice with the old double guns. <laughs> 18. That'll be this. Or about a nat 20. That'll hit. Yeah. Let me see here. Crit damage. Roll it. Oh, one on both of them? That is the worst. Wow. Nine damage. Wow. I got I got one and one too. So mm. don't feel too bad. It Aerial? hurts, you know. It yeah. really hurts. It really does. Uh, only moving myself uh, further out of harm's way and reach, or as high up as I can go. Last turn. Okay, Nick, your turn. Right. Gonna steady aim, and we're going to B aggressive. B B. B. Okay. So uh, I got an advantage on my longbow plus one. And it looks like a crit. That is a crit, so I can't get any higher than that one. How about, oh, that's a little disappointing. 36 points of piercing damage. 36 points is disappointing? For a crit attack from a level 7 rogue, yes. Yeah, that should have been much higher. Uh, it's dead, though. So oh, good, I like good. Your, I like your standards. <laughs> yes. Just, nah, my my wife crits and it's like eighty. It's yeah. <laughs> anything else? Well actually I guess that's the end of the combat. Alright, now let's root loot the room. Freak, somebody right. put on one of their helmets. You go blind again. And you <laughs> back on a <laughs> forest <laughs> island. <laughs> no, no, this no. Seems is familiar chest. somehow. I'm all attuned yeah, up. Um <laughs> Somebody else has to be blind. Are you gonna finish casting the tech magic, or are you just gonna? Yeah, go ahead and finish casting. We're all yeah, we're all, all visible now. now, so. And oh, hopefully, man. killing the helm horrors didn't cost. Did hopefully this entire place is soundproofed. All right, so you guys find. Let's see what's in your chest. A, yes. Uh, you guys find in the room a plus one battle axe, a plus one short sword, and a plus one scale mail. Hmm. Plus one I don't short think sword. I can use any of that. Yeah, plus one short sword and a plus one scale mail. Yeah, I don't think anyone can use the scale mail. Yeah. Uh, you can um, use the short sword. I think it'd probably be worse AC. Yeah, you can use the <laughs> short sword. Short sword. The or battle axe. axe. Samantha could use that. Samantha. She already got a. I've got a plus sweet glaive. Yeah. Yeah. Well. Ooh, I'll use the treasure. battle axe. <laughs> drop it on people. I could use the plus one short sword if I wanted to. I don't know why she would have a whole vault for this treasure. But yeah, I think put that, just put them in the, the we'll see if we can sell them later. Uh, any uh, any gold or anything in these chests or anything like that? Nope. Anything else? A note? Nope. Excellent. Okay. So it looks like we have... We'll take the helmets too, just to sell later. Yeah. Not worth anything. They give you blindside for 60 feet. 
Not in this world. It's canon. It's canon to another world. Not this one though. <laughs> so do we so we go north, we go to the art. If we go to the west. Or you guys or you guys could go to your um you guys could go back to your original plan if you want to. That is true. That I actually liked our original plan. Why don't we go up the up, okay? I'm gonna go back out the window. Uh, first I'm gonna wait for the I'm gonna look out the window and wait for the guard to go by. Okay. The guard to go by? Yeah, there's no guard on the outside, by the way. Guards don't go oh, by. Oh, I outside. according to this was in a the guy original going thing there was a patrol. There's a patrol. Yeah. 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 It's in the inside though. No, there's, there's no exterior patrol, I don't think. Uh, look at your map that you sent us. There's a patrol on the outside. And there's a little dude out there. And there's a little dude up there. Yeah. To indicate a patrol. What's he doing? Oh, there? maybe there is. Hold on. Yeah. Uh. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Only one guard patrols around the, the outside of the building. Yeah, got one dude working on the outside of the building. Yeah, so uh, gonna go um, wait for him to go by, and then mm -hmm. go out, climb up. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, yeah, just climb up. What's that? Give me a stealth check. Yeah, so I am going to activate my cat's blessing for ten minutes. I get plus two to that. Should be stealth. There we go. Another advantage. So twenty-three. All right, you get on the roof. All right, uh, and then I lower a rope and I tie it off so that uh, they everyone can climb up. Obviously, Raz can just fly up, but Raz and I'll uh, tie off the rope and let Samantha and Annabelle climb. I'll go ahead and climb. Yeah, I need all of you to do self checks. Sounds great. Seventeen. Okay. Eleven. Twenty-eight. Jeez, right. whiz. Uh, wow. So, uh, Raz, as you go up, uh, the guard. Um, patrolling the building appears to be rounding the corner as he looks back and he sees you flying. Uh, hello? Sir, what are you doing there, sir? I don't speak common! <laughs> uh, sir, sir, you, you can't go up there. You see him start reaching for his weapon. Uh, I'm afraid I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. How far away is he? Maybe about uh, 30, 40 feet. He hasn't seen me yet, right? Nope. Wait, 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 wait. 30 or 40 feet. I would like to make him... Uh, give me a constitution save. As I whip out my gem brightness from my pouch and hit him with a blind. He's a con save? Con save. Uh, that'll be a 16. Man, are you cheating? Hmm. It's no, one, no, no. Yeah, that, that saves. I'm going to hit him with my longbow. He can't see me, right? Nope. So, I advantage on that? Yep. Uh, let's see, a 22 or a 11. Yeah, 22. <laughs> to hit? 19 right. points of damage. All right. Anyone else do anything? Annabelle, you guys have not been seen, by the way. Have we climbed up, or is this in the process yeah, you of us guys, climbing you guys, up? You guys, by this point, have climbed up. Okay. Basically, this is a surprise round before he calls for back. He's, he's, about, he's about to call for an alarm. So oh, we have to hit him now. Throw your boomerang. Do something. <laughs> I I am going to Superman jump. Uh, what? All right. Down to him. All right. I mean, uh, let me roll some damage. 
and, and make attacks. Uh, you'll take 11 points of bludgeoning. Okay. Make me your attacks. Did you rage before that? Yeah, I would rage and jump, so. So, five points of bludgeoning. Yeah. But how much bludgeoning does he take for taking a Samantha from the second floor? <laughs> And it's Samantha from the top ropes. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> um, you know what? Give me an athletics check real quick. The actually. people's elbow coming down. <laughs> Give me an athletics check, Samantha. Yeah. Not the greatest 14. Uh, for his deck save. He fails his deck save. So uh, he gets a full elbow of Samantha, and he also takes a lot of points of damage. It's still your turn, by the way. You can okay. do whatever you want for your action. Uh, so 21 to hit. That'll hit. Or 19 slashing. All right. Because I just impale him with the glaive. Yep. And I do it again. I don't know. Cover his face oh, with a pillow. On. Uh, 20 to hit. That'll hit. Or 21 points. Oh, he's dead. There we go. And I just want to pick up the body and, and bring it back up the rope. Yeah. Yeah. As the patrolling guard on the exterior is now dead. Um... <laughs> I look up a Raz and I'm just like, guard on the shoulder and I'm just like. <laughs> All right. All right. Attitudes like yeah. that will not get you enlarged again. <laughs> you guys have gotten up on the roof. Well, let's search this guard. Is there a key on him or anything we might need for ingress? True. Um... Uh, does not have a key? That's a good question. He does not have a key on him. Okay. Okay. So, what would you guys like to do? All right. I guess we're well, going around to the balcony. Is it time to summon them in on these people? Yes. I'm going to keep my map open and see if I can see down off into where we're trying to go. Um. Yeah, I guess you could. Um... So you can use it a few times. You get this kind of general layout of the upper floor. Oh, uh, ooh, okay. There's no way in. Is there a way in, Raz? You got anything special that can get us in there? No, I do want to point out the whole building is made of stone. And the cracks are knuckles. Oh no, actually, that makes the too wall, much noise. The, the, the walls do actually have hit points. No, <laughs> do they really? Yeah, For but some reason this module did give them hit points. And make noise. What does the roof have noise? The roof have. I guess it's the same thing. If only one of you had silence. If only we take out all the guards. I, okay, so what do you think about just taking out the guards? <laughs> I just guys? looked at the AC and the HP of the of the walls and the walls and floors. Yeah, we're gonna have to take those two out right there. I have Leash. a guard I can throw at them. Well, I also have a uh, demon. Let me pull up the stats for it. But uh, I'm worried about. We don't want to make noise doing it. Demon would be oh, I thought that ship had sailed. I don't think they know we're here. I'll you, try to you hear, you, hear, you do hear a conversation. You do hear a conversation from them because uh, you're on the roof at this point. You hear, yeah. where did Jimmy go? He, he hasn't like walked around in a while. Yeah, that's weird. I, I don't know where he went. <gasps> Jimmy. Oh, wait. Who's got the hat of disguise? I do. You could be Jimmy. Be Jimmy. <gasps> Thank you, Jimmy. 
right. I'm gonna try to beat Jimmy. Okay. Yeah. So you, you got a good look at him. Uh, you could beat Jimmy. We still have Jimmy. We still have him. <laughs> <laughs> so what are you doing? Get okay. So I'm gonna be Jimmy, and I am going to, uh, I guess, slide down the side of the building and try to come up on the ladder and be like, "Hey, guys." Okay. I'm on break. Uh, they'll look at you and go, oh, Jimmy, there you are. You're on break? Why did you, what? It's not breaking yeah. yet. Taking up smoking. There's just nothing <laughs> going on right now. Just just chilling, you know? Well, you never know if something could happen. I mean, you know, Viterant has us here to keep track of everything. And, you know, you have they know. Bunched, have they bunched together? They're not bunched together. Over, They're still talking over over like, So where, where, where are you at on the roof, uh, Annabelle? Uh, I am uh, right still here. next to the ladder. Yeah, like right there. Let me see where my little character is. Yeah, I'm going to put myself out there as well. Oh, I'm way up here, way down here. So we're on the yeah. back side of it. Yeah. I'm going to be like, what? That's crazy. So, yeah, we're up here. Well, I mean, you know. Can I really like happens. pretend to pat him on the back and then, but like do an unarmed strike and try yeah, to kill him? Yeah, give me, and give me can I, can I. Can I shoot as soon as that happens? Which one? The one that she just attacked. Okay, well, hold on. Or, Don't look at me an unarmed strike. Yeah, unless you're going to stun him. At advantage. I'm going to stun him, so. Yeah. If I can. Yeah, give me an unarmed strike right. first. All right. At advantage. At advantage. Whoa. Uh, 16? So you're I guess that's our advantage. It that's didn't. Fun. It didn't roll right. Uh, yeah, yeah, you rolled a nine and a two. Oh, oh okay. Yeah, so nine. Okay, so plus nine. Seven. It's sixteen. Is your total? Is your top? Okay, yeah. So it is right. Yeah. 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 Uh, that'll hit. All right, and then I'm going to spend a key point to try to stun him. Okay, I need to hit that make a con save. Oh my gosh, uh, t dirty twenty. Oh my gosh. Oh, well, he saved. I'm gonna be like, oh, dude, there was a bug on your back. That's crazy. And, and at the same damage. time, can I fire my bow at this guy? Yeah. With advantage, because he doesn't see me. Four. Okay. <laughs> uh, one more. Detail. Yeah. Wow, that really is awful. Wow. Oh, there it is. Oh my gosh. 17. That'll hit. 23 points of piercing damage. All right. And can I throw the real Jimmy at the one he just shot? Yeah. Trying to basically throw him off the roof <laughs> with Jimmy. Don't throw him off the roof. Jimmy bomb. Uh, like that's my goal yeah. is to chunk this body in such a way that it's like hitting yeah. him and they're both tumbling over the roof. Give me the athletics check. That's a 19. You felt this deck save. Are you talking the one on the left or the one on the right? Uh, the, the one on the I left. Just hit. Yeah, yeah, the one okay. I just hit. Uh, yeah, so Jimmy hits him as he falls down. He's gonna take some falling damage. Here. Actually, uh, Samantha, roll me 2d6. Okay. That's seven. Would he take some bludgeoning damage from being hit with Jimmy? Yeah, one extra bludgeoning damage, I'll say. Or well, not one extra, but one extra die. Okay. Plus my strength? Oh, uh, yeah, I'll say plus your strength. Okay. Plus his raging. Yep. Uh, rage doesn't count on thrown weapons. I'm not. Uh, but that is a six on that. So plus my ra my strength is uh, 11. Just for that second. Still 18. Damage. Yeah, so in total for knocking him over, it's 18 damage. Yeah. Um, Raz, what do you think you're doing? Oh. I'm afraid if we leave these guys alive, they're going to start alarming. Um, I mean, you've got one falling to his death, hopefully. Yeah, this other guy. That's... Uh, uh, 
Did they do much damage to him in this one? He's taking four. He's taking he's, four. Yeah, he's taking four damage. All right. I would need a wisdom save from him. All right. Uh, will be a failure. He is Tasha's hideous laughter. <laughs> okay. Oh, no. <laughs> So he's, he's incapacitated and prone. <laughs> laughing and hysterically laughing. as his friend just fell to his death. <laughs> yeah. Right. Um, so as as that happens, you hear the guard on the lower floor yell, Back up! I need backup! As that's where we're going to end it.